All right, guys, quick update on this information that was released today. The honeymoon period is over and the UK is now implementing ETA uh, if you need to get to the United Kingdom from next year, 2025, for a number of Caribbean countries. So those of you who had a grand honeymoon all these years, that time is now up. Let's go through the list quickly. The UK government has unveiled the timetable for the rollout of its electronic travel authorization for visa exempt travelers from January 8, 2025. Tourists from Canada, United States, and 47 countries and territories will need an electronic travel authorization before traveling to the United Kingdom. Citizens of the European countries will need an ETA to cross the channel from April 2nd, 2025. So where are the Caribbean countries? Well, UK ETA extended to 49 countries from January the 8th. So as of January the 8th, a number of Caribbean countries, if you're traveling to the UK, you're going to need an ETA authorization, all right? In a press release published today, the UK government announced that nationals of 49 countries and territories will be able to apply for ETA authorization from November 27th, 2024. Visitors from these countries will be required to hold an ETA to travel to the UK from January 8, 2025. So here is the list of 49 countries affected by the first stage in the rollout of the ETA. Now I'm going through the Caribbean countries for you. Antigua and Barbuda, the Bahamas, Barbados, Belize, Grenada, Guyana, going down the list and back up. And we see on this side, St. Kitts and Nevis, St. Lucia, St. Vincent and the Grenadines, Trinidad and Tobago. So these are the islands in the Caribbean that will need an ETA. And if you're traveling to the UK anytime from January 8, 2025, you're going to need that ETA if you're going to get into the UK. We had an excellent honeymoon period and now that honeymoon period is over and this is what the UK government is stipulating for individuals from these islands. All right, the ETA cost 10 pounds or around 12 euro or US $13. And the ETA is valid for two years or until the passport expires. If it is less valid and allows multiple trips to the UK during this period, the ETA allows its holder to come to the UK for up to six months for tourism, to visit families and friends, for business, for short-term study or transit through the country.